fight is brewing at the state capitol between home builders and cities. A bill is moving forward that could allow builders to pick their own inspectors. New specialist Daniel Woodruff live at the capitol tonight. Daniel, what's behind this? Well, Dini and Mike, supporters of this idea say it's a way to get home inspections done quicker and better, saving money in the process. But opponents argue it introduces a whole host of problems that could be dangerous for home buyers. In North Salt Lake, new homes are going up. So we're in the Ridge subdivision. This is a new mixed use development. City manager Ken Leatham shows me around. When houses are built, they need to be inspected something he says North Salt Lake does right away. I think inspections are best done by cities. It's our responsibility to do them. But Senate Bill 185 would change how things are done. Under the latest version, a builder in Utah could pick their own state-approved inspector if a city doesn't do the inspection within three days. Competition drives better customer service. Senator Evan Vickers is sponsoring the bill. You know, if the cities are looking at it correctly, they would say, well, if we do our work within three days, we're fine. And if not, maybe we ought to step up our game. The Utah Home Builders Association believes this will get homes built quicker, thereby reducing costs. Anytime in the market we see competition introduced, we see prices go down and quality go up. That's all this does. But they're running into opposition from the Utah League of Cities and Towns. We feel like when the entity that's being regulated picks their own regulator, that creates a potential conflict of interest that can undermine public safety. Executive Director Cam Deal also points out most cities already inspect on time. And it has multifamily, it has townhomes. That makes Leatham wonder why push this in the first place. I'm not sure that this bill really solves a problem. But this bill is moving. It passed the Utah Senate yesterday. It now awaits some action of some kind in the House of Representatives. There are just three days left in the legislative session. Back to you. Yeah, busy day, busy days, I should say, ahead up at Capitol Hill. Daniel, thank you.